Luck fires it inside. Oh, there goes T.Y. Hilton. Andrew Luck, Indianapolis Colts quarterback, was seen throwing football, uh, seen throwing footballs for like the first time in 530 days. Are you buying into the hype that he'll be just fine to start the year? I just hope he was throwing footballs with his right hand and not his left. Uh, I don't know, man. I, I mean, look, I had a torn labrum. Yeah. I can tell you that it was excruciatingly painful. I mean, I'm telling you, I couldn't move my arm back like this far. So I couldn't imagine having 300 pound guys hit me. Um, do I think luck will be back? Yes. Do I think that he may be undervalued? Maybe. Will I draft him? Probably not. Not where somebody else is going to, right? I would take luck in maybe round 10, 11, 12. Somebody's going to jump on him sooner. That doesn't mean he can't come back, but I know what kind of injury that is. It's major. I mean, obviously he missed, what, a season and a half now? So I am I have trepidation with Andrew Luck. I'll draft him, but more as a – I would love to draft him with another quarterback together and have two guys and have, like, Luck and Phillip Rivers or something like that. I think my team would be better if I did that. Let me talk to you about Andrew Luck's top target, T.Y. Hill, an ADP of around 51. I think he's super undervalued if we know Luck is healthy, but that's really the dilemma, isn't it? Look, if Luck is healthy – Marlon Mack, Jack Doyle, T.Y. Hilton, Eric Ebron, Niam Hines, they all have value. They all have value. So I think it's one of those things, depending on when you draft, if you draft tonight and you go in on the Colts and luck is healthy, you're going to win some leagues. I mean, you're going to really win leagues. I have no problem doing it. I'm with you. T.Y. Hilton was a second round pick, what, a year ago? So now he's at 51. It, it could be a steal. I like, I'm a gambler. I like taking the moves, the risky moves that can pay off.